Next to the growing outrage after a piece of video showing two adults at an elementary school in Georgia preparing to paddle a five-year-old child. It's perfectly legal in that state and in 18 other states. But parents across this country are divided. ABC's Steve Osinsami with the video and the debate tonight. You're gonna get a fight again. Georgia police say what you're about to see in a public grade school is perfectly legal. The five-year-old's mother, who recorded the video, gave her consent to school officials to paddle her son after they say the boy fought with other children and then spat on a teacher. For many parents who've seen this tonight, it's deeply disturbing and for many others, just fine. Thank you. But 22-year-old Shayna Perez now says she felt pressured to let them hit her child, worried she'd be sent to jail after more than three weeks of his unexcused absences. I wish that I could go back and stop all this. I'd have snatched him up and said, take me to jail. You know what, suspend him, I don't care. Georgia is one of at least 19 states that still allows corporal punishment in schools. An estimated 167,000 public school children are physically disciplined every year. Authorities here in Jasper County say they never threaten Perez with jail. So you do spank him? Yeah, but I mean, they were shaking him around and holding him down. And I mean, you just, you don't do something like that to a five-year-old baby. The school says because of privacy issues, they can't discuss details of this case, but tell us they're re-examining discipline issues, underlining that corporal punishment is allowed here with parental consent. David. ABC's Steve Osinsami tonight. Steve, thank you.